Hey, all the graphic dreamers, welcome. This is uh, our review for today, the Forms. And uh, what's the brand of it? Is it the name of the company, Forms? I think the Forms is the name of the company. Okay, so the Forms, so they're actually, this is uh, for sports, and uh, we have AR coming everywhere, even in your swimming pool. So now when you're swimming, you can have uh, statistic and information. Um, I think this is a great idea. Uh, I used to try that with my Pebble, or I should try to other type of smartwatch to get the count uh, when you're swimming laps. And it was really inaccurate and having, I didn't find one that ever worked actually. Um, so we're gonna put those to test. Uh, Anna is gonna go and swim uh, with them and then give us some feedback and then we'll come back and do some uh, more, um, more conclusions and review on it. Let you know how it goes. These are the form goggles. Um, they're uh, competitive swim goggles with an augmented reality display that can display um, like your time, your split stroke, um, a whole bunch of really useful things that can really transform how swimmers um, train. It syncs to your phone. And so there's an app that you download on your phone called Form. It tells you the instructions with the box. It's very useful. And pretty much it can, so the display that it can show you it can either show you split time, stroke rate, stroke counts, distance per stroke, um, your pace, so every 50, every time you'll split turn, it'll tell you like what your pace was for 50 if you're doing like a long distance course. It'll even tell you how many calories you're burning, which is pretty useful. And it'll even count your count your laps, which is pretty cool for a swimmer because we usually lose track and it's very, very nice. So I'm just going to unbox it because it's always fun. So it comes with the the little instructions on these pads right here, which is pretty useful. There's a charger that comes with it. They come charged, so it, that's usually completed very fast. Um, the charger's in here. Okay, so these are the goggles. They come with multiple nose pieces, in case since our eyes are at different levels. And these are the goggles. They look pretty much like normal Vanquisher goggles, so that's pretty good. Um, they have the little display here. I'm going to try and test flip turning really fast and see if it creates any drag and if they move because I feel like this is, it looks pretty bulky. And so I'm a little bit afraid that it'll create drag and be uncomfortable and like readjust. Um, so once you sync, once you sync the goggles with your phone on your app, they sync pretty fast, which is good. You can choose if you want to do intervals or if you want to do a lap swim. And so depending on that, um, you'll have a different display. So if you turn them on, the display is only, well, you can choose what eye you want it on. I'm just going to leave it on my right eye. It's a, just a yellow display. Okay, I'm going to set it for, I put it on the interval mode and I'm going to set it for showing my time. So my total time on the top, and then on the bottom, I'm gonna make it show my split time. So every time I flip turn, it'll tell me how many, how long it took to swim my 50. So there are two buttons on the side. There's a power button, and we'll just and the front and back button. And pretty much you go through, and you can flip through and choose just using those two buttons. And it's just front and back, which is very useful. Um, you can say how long, how high, long the pool is. So if it's in meters, if it's in yards, if it's long distance or short distance. Um, yeah, let's try it out. They fit pretty comfortably. So right when I put them on, the display turns on which is very useful. And I think right when I start swimming, the time will start. So let's go and see. Okay, so when I first jumped in, um, the goggles weren't properly put on, they weren't tight enough, and so when I pushed off the wall, this really created a lot of drag and they kind of tilted off. So 
because it's up on the other end to fix it. And when I tightened it, it worked a bit better, but I can still definitely feel it when I push off the wall. Um, it's way heavier on one side, and I can feel there's a drag and it kind of shifts. So I would say to really adjust the goggles really well. Um, I don't know how it would work to dive with them. Um, I don't know, I can't really try, but um, it's definitely gonna create a drag and they might move, which is very not, it's uncomfortable when you're racing and you have water in your goggles. So that is a downside. Um, the display is really nice. It really, you can see where you're going and you can see the display really nicely. Um, when you rest, it stops counting, so that's good. It tells you you're on a rest and um, yeah. Welcome back, Anna. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> um, you're pretty dry. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, um, let's go over the, the hardware a little bit more in detail. Uh, here, um, so there is those different nose pieces here. That you can change uh, based on your uh, your size, so to fit better. Um, they're good quality glasses. The um, the actual AR part is pretty small, so it's pretty impressive. You can see the this is the AR part, the AR computer that's in there um, for something that's you know water resistant and uh, and pretty well integrated. It's pretty well sealed. To the, the element there and you can see if you look closely I don't know if you guys see it there's like this little prism inside the glasses in there like a little mirror um, so that's the projector reflecting in there and the dif display is very basic as you've seen uh, in the previous video um, but I found the build pretty interesting compared to other hardware and uh, overall I'll say it's pretty light overall um, yeah way light lighter than the phone um, so I like that uh, that design and the build of it. Um, for sure, as Anna mentioned, there's a drag problem. So maybe, you know, they can balance that with another something here that's just uh, very light, but actually can uh, manage that part of the, of the drag. Um, and other than that, I think that's all I have to say for the hardware. Because it looks pretty sturdy. It looks, uh, it's, it looks like really good quality. Yeah, the all goggles. Overall. The goggles are pretty much like regular goggles. It's just this little added part. So like all the the silicone right here, it fits perfectly, and the plastic seems nice. So it's good. Yeah, so they're good, pretty high quality in there. Um, now we're gonna go more about the. Um, you mentioned that a little bit in the previous part, but tell me a bit more the usefulness for a swimmer because I don't swim much. Um, well, the main part that I think is interesting is that it'll give you your time straight away. So while you're swimming, I know that what is annoying for me is when I'm swimming, I don't have to look up either when I'm swimming, I try to read the clock. That's kind of a struggle or I have to wait till I'm done with the set. And then I look at the clock and I see my time here. It gives me my time constantly. So if I feel like I'm slowing down, I can see it if my time is getting really high. Um, it can also tell me my split stroke. So pretty much if Coaches usually they stand on the side they have a timer and they kind of like wait for you and they'll tell you your time when like when you do a 50 they'll tell you a time if you're doing more than a 50 to see if you got slower on the second 50 and here it'll tell you automatically so you won't even need your coach like yelling at you from the pool and you not being able to listen because you're in the water so I think that's really useful um, I also find it funny that it counts your laps because I know when I do long distance my mind just goes off and so I forget and so counting the laps is really useful um yeah it's kind of like you have instead of having your coach a, like hovering above you counting like measuring all your time you have the glasses for you cool so that's perfect for training yeah it's really good for okay training. awesome cool uh yeah in terms of hardware device, i some all the hardware that i've seen re reminds me of the recon jet um at, at its time so something really light uh slight and very specialized into a sport for a very specific need. Uh, so I think those will look like really good glasses. Um, you went over the app and the features in terms of the glasses in the app. Can you tell us a little bit more about the additional social part that's part of the mobile app? Yeah, so pretty much I said how you can save the data from each of your swims and it'll show up on your app. And cur uh, with that, you can either share it or you can keep it to yourself. And so there's this whole like, kind of social media thing where you can follow different swimmers and you can show and post your swims with your times, your stats, like your strokes and all the calories you burn. Literally everything that it records, you can put it on like a post and other people can like it and stuff. 
So it's like Strava for swim swimmer. Yeah, pretty much. And your coach can also see it, which is really useful. Um, is there a specific share for the coach, or it's? Uh, I'm not just sure a about that. that's what I've been trying to find. Um, I don't see that, so I feel like you just post it. Um, there's a either an only me section, so you don't actually have to post all of your stuff, or there's a following. So I think I think you can probably share it. Yeah, you can share your swim. You can delete it. You can edit it. So I think if you share it, you can share it with your coach. Cool. Um, so yeah, it's a very simple, a very specialized device. Uh, there's not much more uh, that we can say today about it. Uh, so we can go in a short conclusion right now. So I think it's a, uh, I mean, I like the sturdiness of it. Uh, and I like the, the build. It feels really good and sturdy. It is all water resistant. Uh, I, I wore them so. just for playing around and uh, they felt pretty good compared to the cheap uh, glasses I usually buy. So I think uh, for the price of uh, um, of it, I think they're, they're a good deal. Uh, if you uh, need some training and tracking, uh, they work pretty well. Um, anything else to add to? I just think it's useful. Um, if you don't always have a coach around with you, you can use those and uh, they can help you out. Cool. Okay, holographic dreamers, follow after now. Thank you. Bye.